Now we have an interview with a council member of the Ghana Assorted Foods Exporters Association, Food Stuff Exporters Association, GEFA, um, which has been operating since uh, 1989. She's in the person of Pasta Lydia Anti. You're warmly welcome to New Day. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm wonderful. Are you? Very well, thank you. Um, what, what exactly is the core business of GEFA? And Gafia uh, represents uh, the Ghana Food Stop Exporters Association. Mm -hmm. And uh, we export a lot of things. Yam, banku, fufu, maize, okay. widiaba, benkuta, you name it, pepe. Mm -hmm. We do it all, okay. you see. And uh, we send it overseas. Now, bear in mind that export mm -hmm. is the backbone that drives the national economy. Mm -hmm. We bring in the income, income into the country, mm. you see. Uh, so therefore, uh, Garfia, our main job is to send foodstuffs abroad and then we bring in the foreign exchange. Okay. Government benefits, the business owner Most benefits, benefits exactly. the whole country benefits. Mm. Yeah. So what are, what, what are the benefits of being a member? Um, actually, if you are a Garfia member, yes. uh, you enjoy a lot of privileges. Okay. Uh, for example, I'm sitting here trying to educate mm. people about our issues and concerns. And then to be able to get other exporters outside there who do, do not know that Garfia exists. We've mm. been around for 33, 36 mm. years, mm. since 1983, you see. Okay. So maybe someone doesn't know that we are here. And then uh, when you join Garfia and you have issues, mm. which we hardly Mm. Uh, get some because uh, it's really well regulated. We've got a place that we package everything and all of that mm. uh, for exporting. So if you are a member, you have a place to, you know, um, package your uh, exporting mm. uh, 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 foodstuffs. Yeah. Um, then we'll also show you the procedures. Okay. Uh, now we are into the global gap and traceability age. Okay. Uh, maybe you don't know the system <laughs> and you are new. Um, if you are hearing my voice and you're an exporter, come to Gafia. We'll be able to take you through the entire process okay. to make it easier for you. Mm. And you've got a lot of benefits as well. Yeah. We'll be able to guide you uh, through exporting yeah. so that some of the loopholes in export, mm. uh, whereby you will lose a lot of revenue, uh, will, will be drastically reduced. Mm, okay. Yeah. And now you, you export um, organic food. Yes, non-traditional um, exports. No, yeah. Non-traditional exports. Yeah. That must be costly to store and to export. Um, yes, but the thing is that, you know, uh, you go a lot on trainings so and mm. we'll train you okay. uh, as to how to preserve your products. Okay. Okay. And then be, because you are following standards and procedures, mm. um, so you will be able to handle things appropriately. Okay. Uh, you follow international standards, including... Uh, the Ghana Standards Authority and okay. that of the FDA, SEPS, mm. uh, Ministry of Trade, PPRSD, Plan Quarantine. Yeah. You have to fall within all these procedures. And GAFIA is there to uh, guide you uh, okay. as a, a new exporter so okay. that, you know, you, you follow the procedures and then your, your export will go smoothly for you. For you, okay. Now away from uh, membership, between January and June of um, 2016, um, GAFIA members lost a coastal um, amount of uh, approximately 200 and 40,000 US dollars, all because of handling. Yes. Now, how, why should handling be a problem? Why is handling a problem? You see, uh, packaging is the main thing. Okay. Uh, if you go to the market mm. uh, and uh, they wrap something very ugly and something really nice, maybe whatever they wrap that is not too appealing might be tasty and nice, mm. but I won't go for it. The sight, uh, you know, it's repulsive. Mm. I'll choose the most beautiful thing. So packaging sells. Okay. All right. And then we are looking at quality of packaging. Okay. Okay. So therefore handling of products is mm. very, very important. Mm. One for quality. All right. If it's not quality, I won't buy. Okay. And if I won't buy, uh, the next uh, uh, neighbor will not buy. Okay. So you need to uh, package your things very well. And then you have to use the appropriate uh, materials. Then again, you are looking at cost. Mm. Look, we are in a situation whereby when we package our products, mm -hmm. okay, we, we have to go through a procedure. Mm. So we are looking at SEPs, uh, Ghana uh, 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 Custom Exercise and Preventive Service. They have to do their checks. We are looking at Narcotics Control Board. 
they have to ensure that there's no whatever in there, drugs mm. or whatever. Mm. Uh, we're looking at plant quarantine, yeah. okay? We're looking at FDA, okay. the Ministry of Trade. Mm. Now, all this chain block, mm. we have to go through the entire process before we can export. It's not an easy task. Yeah. From one place to the other. Imagine you are uh, exporting a, 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 a whole container or two containers of jam. And then you'll be going through all these processes from one place to the other. Mm. And all that we are asking is a single corridor pack house. Okay. okay? And what we are saying is that if all these uh, uh, stakeholders yeah. will come at one chunk of a place, okay. eh? instead of me taking my yam to a uh, port, mm. to my port, mm. then uh, you do all these checks, or the airport, and then you crash my, uh, you open my, uh, what do you call, my okay. boxes, mm -hmm. mess them up. And sometimes the sniff dogs, instead of them coming to sniff and see whether there's uh, any uh, no, drug perfect. or whatever yeah. in there, they will end up chewing the fish mm. and all of that. At your loss, yeah, you get it. Exactly. And uh, who are we to, uh, you know, um, fight with government? We mm. can't, you see. Yeah. Uh, so therefore, all we are asking is that uh, we need a single corridor pack house, a one-stop shop, okay. whereby all these stakeholders, uh, Ministry of Trade, Plant Quarantine, SEPs, FDA, mm. You know, they'll all be at one place. Mm. Then they will do the inspections. Mm. When they are done with the checks, we will just, uh, you know, send it to the port as easy as mm. ABC. Well, it, mm -hmm. It's not like it's not been done mm. before. Uh, we've had uh, 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 meetings with the Ministry of Trade. Actually, they've even accepted it, yeah. okay, that they, they are in for the single corridor pack house. Okay. Garfia have stated that we've got a very big land mm. there. Okay, we are already into processing. Yeah. So we process every day and it passes through your corridor. So yeah. it's not like it's something new. Yeah. We are doing it. But all we are asking is that uh, to maintain handling yeah. and for quality and then to cut down cost because it comes at a loss to the okay. exporter. You, okay. you understand? And believe you me, if, if we are not in existence, we add a lot of money to the uh, Ghana's economy. Mm, you see? Is. So all we are asking is that we need at uh, this we are appealing yeah okay that they should come on board and come and help us okay. uh, look governments will uh, uh, deduct their revenue from it mm. it's not free but yeah. we can do it because we have to follow appropriate authority yeah you see so if they don't give uh, uh, that mandate we will not be able to mm -hmm. operate yeah you see yeah we have the place there yeah. all we are asking and we've had uh, uh, conversations back and forth with them they've yeah. accepted it so now we want to see uh, it uh, uh, manifest. Yes. We want implementation. So the place is already there. You just need the officers and all of um, the stakeholders to be present That's all. in the chain so yeah. that it's done once and for all. That's it. Okay. All right. Are there any other problems that you are facing? Um, actually, our main problem is uh, the handling. To okay. be honest, it's, it's okay. costing us a lot of money. Mm. And, and it's really, really, it's not funny. If... Uh, it's coming from your side. Mm. Your things can be crushed when it goes abroad. When you use inferior uh, uh, product, yeah. uh, inferior uh, packaging, packaging, or for instance, even if it's not inferior, mm -hmm. okay, but because of the handling process, you know how uh, our brothers and sisters out there, yes, exactly. uh, they, they, they look at quality. Yeah. And if they notice that your boxes are whatever, they, they, they'll just crush your goods. Oh, and wow. sometimes some of the things are highly perishable. Okay. For instance, uh, you, if you are taking yam yeah. Okay, yeah. abroad, or yeah. let's say shea butter, yeah. and then you, you leave it at the mercy of the sun for hours, yeah. because uh, one of the stakeholders, maybe a PPRSD or whatever, mm. any of them have been come doing the checks. Just imagine what will happen to the shea indeed, butter. Indeed. Or, or you leave the uh, yam yeah. at the mercy of the sun. Yeah. You can just imagine that the temperature, look at our weather. Mm. By the time it's reached abroad with the, the cold weather, yeah. it's already cooked. It's mm. mashed. Oh, it's, wow. It becomes like a mashed uh, um, uh, uh, potato. Oh, you, wow. uh, they will just crush your, uh, uh, your products. And then it will be at the loss uh, of the exporter. Mm. You see, for uh, our products not to be at the mercy of the weather yeah. and then cost, yeah. then we are looking at quality. Exactly. You get it? Yeah. So all we are asking, we are humbly appealing to the government. Yeah. You've accepted the Ministry of Trade have written to us, yeah. Gafia. Okay? okay. We are just humbly appealing to them that we've got a, a big land there, the edifice. All we need 
uh, is for them to uh, accept it. Okay. And uh, let's see the implementation go on. Okay, thank you so much. Um, well, you've heard it, um, Ministry of Trade and Industry, Ghana Export Promotion Authority, GIPC, uh, Ghana Standards Authority, Food and Drugs Authority, and all other stakeholders, um, Gafia is calling on you to help them out so that they can also maximize their profits um, as businessmen and businesswomen.